shirt on me because I am so tall um, from happymonday.com I did a review on some of their clothes so if you want to check out that video I will link it right here and also the description bar but yeah they're kind enough to send me some clothes for Halloween so this is my she devil makeup tutorial it was actually really super fucking easy to do so if you're in like a last minute pinch for a costume idea this would be a good one to go for and it's a little bit of a different spin on like a classic look so if you guys would like to see how I got this makeup then please keep watching and let's just get started we're gonna start this look off with our Kryolan aqua color UV day glow palette using the pink shade from there and apply it all over the face neck ears I am not going down all the way to my neck because I don't want to completely fuck up my shirt you know what I'm saying but feel free to apply it on all the areas that are going to be exposed. And I would suggest applying about five to six layers. I did about three, maybe four. And you can kind of tell it's not super opaque. Once we add a bit of shadow though, it'll kind of cover that up. So it doesn't really matter. For contouring, I decided to go with a pink color, so I'm using my Suva Beauty Riki Riki, <laughs> I don't know if that's how you say it, uh, but you can use any kind of hot pink that you have and apply this to the contours of the face, so temples, hollows of the cheeks, jawline, and I'm going to add a bit of a white shadow to all the highlight points of the face. Now I'm going to apply some blush. I decided to use an orange blush. Uh, you could use red or purple, whatever you want. But I'm using papaya from my Suva Beauty palette. I'm just going back and further diffusing the edges and adding a little bit more highlight. Next onto brows, I'm going to use a black eyeshadow here and just follow the natural shape of your eyebrow. I did apply a little bit of a primer here and I'm using the same pink that I had applied for contouring and adding that to the lid, also bringing that slightly down the bridge of the nose. Now I'm applying a plum shade to the crease. Now I'm applying a black eyeshadow to the lid and then blending out. Repeat the same steps for the lower lash line. Onto eyeliner, I've applied a little bit of black eyeliner in the waterline also. And yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and do that. And once that's finished, I've applied top and bottom lashes. Next on to lips, I'm using my Pretty Zombie Cosmetics lipstick in the shade 3 Witches. And I overlined the shit out of my top lip, so yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I felt my face was a little bit bare so I added a few designs. You can feel free to do this or skip this step, up to you. But I'm lightly outlining where I want to place the sixes and then going over it with a liquid eyeliner. I'm going to do the same steps for the upside down cross in the middle of my forehead. helpful and useful to you in some sort of way and you could use this for Halloween or whatever else you want to use it for I don't fucking know let me know what you guys thought of this makeup and if you like it give this video a thumbs up don't forget to share comment subscribe to my channel if you haven't already I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video bye